Okay, you're good. All right. So we're going to see uh, Chaco Milkman sticking with the fox. Uh, that is his main character. He also has a sheep, uh, but his fox is much better. Uh, Nick Hazard going to go Marth. Uh, we saw that Marth do some pretty good work against Junebug's Falco. Uh, we'll see how it does against this other Spacey. <laughs> Leaf wanting to see the Marth come out and uh, Leaf looking satisfied. Uh, he, does, he does see the Marth. Leaf is uh, he's another Marth player that we usually have out here during the school year. He goes to school in the area, um, but he uh, we don't have him for the summer. So we don't have him for the summer. In the summer, he belongs to the Tri-State. Chocolate Milk Man taking, a, taking an early lead here. Okay, very sharp. Nice up airs. Nick Hazard finally able to SDI out of one. Oh, clips him with a weak bear, and that'll do it for Nick. Uh, Nick had two stocks left. Have yet to take a stock off of Milk Man. Oof. Chaco Milkman just barely working the micro, just barely winning the micro spacing game. Just out of range of uh, Mars aerials, just out of range of Mars crab. That's what he needs to do. This is gonna be a stock. Okay, so that'll be a stock. So Nick Hazard does get one off now. Minute and a half in. Small lead for Chaco Milkman. This could be it. Oh no, not able to fare him off the stage. Definitely would have spelled disaster for Chaco Milkman. Ledge hop up here to forward smash. Fucking quite sharp there. Definitely made sure to take his blade back to the armory. Get it sharp enough as a match against the fox. You can do it, Lil Macklemore! But I believed in you! Doesn't get the up air though. See Chaco Milkman going into shield a lot, and Nick has to get a lot of grabs off of him. He's gotta watch that. Nicely timed bear. The air dodge from Nick. That is something that Nick does a lot as Mark actually. He likes that air dodge to delay ledge grab. Grab there, misses the up tilt. Doesn't miss that up air though. Nick not looking quite sharp enough with these punishes. He's got to be a little bit more careful. Oh, stalls Milkman, Chaco Milkman out just long enough to be able to grab the ledge. Now he's regained stage control over that back air. Is that going to take it? Oh, it is. Wow. Uh, surprising. So Chaco Milkman with a 1 0 lead. Best of five, by the way. Alright, so back to Battlefield. Uh, but Nick going Fox this time. I like this decision. Nick, I believe, normally wins these Fox dinners. Uh, and we saw these guys play in uh, in Winners, actually. And uh, Nick Hazard was able to 2-0 Chaco Milkman in Fox dinners. So even though Chaco Milkman might be able to... Wow. Double falling up air. You know, it's a it's a very high risk move. Um, you've got to come in, and you have to get very very low before that hitbox is, is allowed to come out. So you can get hit by a lot. Uh, basically, if they throw anything out, you're gonna get hit. But that said, 
He gets a big punishes off of it. And Nick Hazard. Nice snare there. Recognizing that he really only had one option. Over oh, the up smash, gonna take it. So Choco, Choco Milkman evening up these stocks. Grab. Not able to get the kill off of it. Oh, that shine. Able to turn around the momentum. He's able to get him off that platform. And Chaco Milkman misses his angle. The tough angle to get, though. Up throw, up air, up smash. Ooh, I was uh, I was actually expecting another up smash there from Nick. I think he would have been able to get it. But I don't think he was expecting to be able to get it. Uh, he probably expected Chaco Milkman to DI away. Uh, so Chaco Milkman able to even up the stocks, not taking too much percent on that stock, but taking a fair amount on this stock. He's bear, but he gets hit by the Firefox, not able to get the shine quickly, but he is able to get that bear and seal the stock. Nick Hazard's punish game as Fox has just looked so, so good today. Just all day. He has barely dropped anything. Okay. And you know, just a little thing there. He went to drop in on the shield, and he got... It, it's not an uncommon thing to see somebody come in on the shield and then go double jump uh, to try to, you know, bait you to do something out of shield. And then they'll attack you on their way down. But Nick went so, so low, almost to the point where he would have tomahawked. Um, and so Choco, Choco Milkman, even though being a very, very smart player, uh, ended up falling for that. Somebody's got to watch. The up throw, up smash, it's going to be some very, very good percent. Guys, just trading aerials, waiting for one of them to miss their shield. Go to bear. Oh, he wanted. He went for the moonwalk. I actually kind of surprised they didn't clanky. They didn't uh, hit each other in the air with these fire foxes. Chocolate milkman caught dying poorly on that back air. Probably went for a shine. This fox punch game is looking much cleaner than Marth. I agree. I agree, his Marth's punish game wasn't quite as strong as, uh, as his Fox's. And that has made the difference. Because he only needs to win neutral, you know, three or four times every stock. As opposed to five or six times every stock. All the soft air. Good choice there by Nick. Choco Milkman unable to, um, unable to punish. There it is. That's the nair he wanted. Uh, but he went way low for it. Uh, definitely committed too much for an option that didn't really pay off for him that much. What, what, these shines by Choco Milkman. Nair playing across the stage. Crunch gets the bear. Oh, misses the second bear though. That's something that these guys have kind of struggled with. Uh, consistent punishes and then getting the optimal punishes. Sometimes they'll trade with Firefox as opposed to just beating it outright. Which, you know, I say, it's it, <laughs> it definitely not the easiest thing in the world. Oh, SD there by Chakra Milkman. <laughs> Skywalker, come on, wrecked! Just runs over to the ledge in shines. The hardest of reads. Like, you're gonna stay there, and I'm gonna shine you. And you're gonna die. And that'll be that. Oh, the down tilt there. He's gonna be able to get back, though. The trade fireboxes. For sure. Both of these guys still living. That they're gonna take it. Alright, so Nick Hazard up two games to one. This is a best of five. 
Nick's got to take one more. Mil Choco Milkman's got to take two more. Choco Milkman counterpicking to Yoshi's. We're going to stick with Fox Dittos, I assume. I wouldn't be surprised to see... Uh, you know, I wonder if he went to Yoshi's. I'm hoping that Nick would counterpick Marth. Uh, because this is this would be a good stage for him to play Marth on. His low platforms make Tipper upsets and Tipper forwards matches very easy. Uh, but Nick has her not falling for the bait, instead knowing that he's going to win the Fox Dittos. He's been winning the Fox Dittos. He's 3-0 versus Choco Milkman and Fox Dittos today, but he's 0-1 in the Fox Dittos. And there's no reason to risk what he doesn't need. And he's already almost taken a second spot off of Choco Milkman. He's got to do something to turn it around. Choco Milkman needs to tighten up his punish game. Uh, and he's a little better micro spacing. Uh, you know, you know, I agree. Um, I agree, Leaf. Uh, Choco Milkman's DI could be a little bit better. Uh, Milkman could not. Or Nick Hazard could, you know, not SD. That would, that would also help. That would help Nick Hazard. Uh, Choco Milkman has been caught DIing poorly uh, all game. You know, he'll go for something and he'll just be a frame or two late. And, you know, he'll be holding down because he wants to do a shine. Or he'll be holding to the side because he wants to do a bear. And then that ends up being a uh, really bad DI. Uh, Nick Hazard is able to get a combo on him. Oh no, is that going to be it? Nope. Time to get the shine. Choco Milkman is starting to turn this around. He's got a lot of ground to cover, though. Ooh, baits out that grab. A pro game. Yeah. See, I mean, you know, even right there, he probably shouldn't have died from that. Um, so Nick Hazard taking it 3-1.